Battle begins. Bottom tower is under attack.
Deceptively weak, they're like their first three, four levels, or two, three minutes. Yeah. But they need SD and Jakira to actually gank and get up in Zai's face. Yeah, same thing <laughs> as last time. Well, Z Freak's able to pick up the rune at least. Defensive disruption this time, he'll skill this up. Yeah. As uh, Doom is trying to stand his ground, he went Infernal Blade. Matumba's dropping low on life, and Chessy, he's actually joined the fight too. Yabsol's trying to finish on Z Freak, but it's Matumba who's in trouble. The dual breath will connect, and one more attack. No, he jumps over, back over towards Puppy. The spirit down to Matumba has to run around, and Matumba will be brought down. Chessy gets the first blood, and then he will go to play brother on brother action Top in the middle. Lane with, with this off lane Necrophos. So Zai against Madara, who went Goo level one, and Jakura having the door breath, it's a hell of a lot of slow. To yeah, work oh yeah, with. You they dropped it down low. Doom is going to die on level. bottom, but uh, yeah. it's, um, that's no, it, he, it, he was three on one. Yeah, uh, oh, sorry for interrupting, but like uh, they can also just get perched off, doomed off. Radiant's middle tower. Like, this is really good for Puppy. He uh, he slipped in behind the lines, put down a Radiant Observer Ward, and he took the bounty rune. So as Chessie comes over to try and uh, refill the bottle up, Puppy's going to try and solo kill Chessie. And he's like, well, my, my rune is gone. Where is my rune? Yeah. And Puppy's waiting on the oh impetus. Wait, wait, is he, blo is he blocked in? Is Puppy actually going to solo kill him? We've seen this at T2 Towers with Chain wow. Lightning Creeps from Puppy before, but he actually just solo Chessie, who thought he was getting a bounty. And they oh, get Jakira to TP over. Puppy's going to this super cool hench build. So uh, nothing in heal, just wants to hit people. Oh, they just keep going on mid. Underneath the tower, Sea Freak able to get a defensive disruption off, but Peksu. Oh, you can get you can get a dual breath, and that's kind of it. An extra TP is on the way, and it's going to be Madara arriving. But Ember Spirit's level six, so they can't control them. Yeah, this is now they're getting outplayed. Run Century of Diocide. Puppy doesn't care. Level four running forward at level five Doom. Doom still only got Chain Lightning while mid lane Astral step yourself out of here, Jesse. He can't take this fight. Getting hit by the duel. Actually, the dual breath actually helps him out with the Absor. Nisha getting caught. Benicia, the spirit, is a little too slow. Ice puff. Control is available. Now he'll spirit tries to get over the other side of the river. A little bit too far away, but that won't stop Matumbleman from getting involved in the fight. Void spirit, another remnant. Buy some extra time. Jakira. No, oh, the side of fist. Nisha. Now we have Chessy on the other side of the tree line. Into the searing chains on Peksu. And five heroes from Team Secret. Four heroes from Team Secret because hey, his eye doesn't need to be there. Yeah. Converging on the T1 tower on mid. And they will take it too. 
Yeah. No, they're playing really good this game. And actually took off the fate of Broach. It was Nietzsche's courier. And there's the remnant. Time to do him. Delete the Ember Spirit if they possibly can. Zion's going to stick with them. Defensive Snowball buys a little bit more time. Zion copying a lot of damage in the meantime. And actually Snowball over, taking him with him over towards the neutral camp. Zion, yeah, he can't get away from this. But you've still got the Doom now going full duration. And Ember Spirit at 50% of his HP. And Doom can now die. As, would you believe it, Matumba has joined the fight. Z Freak will join him in the afterlife. That went well. No, you thought. <laughs> and is still chasing Pexu back to the tower. He'll need four hits to actually get the kill. That's one, that's two. Oh, okay. Can't get the third in, it's too far away. <laughs> that's a little bit rude. While up on top lane, Bristleback dies in the tree line. Couldn't get away from the rest of Team Secret behind the tier two tower. Yeah. No, Bristle also kind of struggles against Tag Team. It's not... Uh, it's not that's, a, that's aggressive, Jesse. I uh, didn't have an international step to get away from this, and now Zai will wait for him. Hold him in position, get ready for the scythe. No, a quick little stuff, uh, step away. It feels like OG wants a fight, but they don't know how to open. Yeah. They're chasing down Puppy, but Puppy is such a... Yeah, Consolation just, prize and the sharp block. <laughs> yeah, uh -huh. Madara. He's not getting close enough on the back on Yapsaw. Down to 34 HP. Very, very low. A jump forward. Does the spirit actually connect? No, it doesn't. It's facing the wrong direction. And the side of Fisiri Chain's catching both of the supports of OG Seed. They do get the purge over on Zai, allowing Chessie to jump forward. But how much they just commit to kill Zai? And what else have you got left in the tank? Zephring trying to play from inside the pit for Matumba. There's a triple kill from him. The spirit finally they'll bring him down, but he's already got the Aegis to the Immortal. Madara being controlled up by Nietzsche with the Searing Chains. Tusk got snowball forwards. They try and battle both sides of this fence. Uh, Madara will finally be brought down as Matumba has the ultra kill and he's looking for the full rampage. TP out, jump forward. Do you see him? They don't see him. Nighttime was too far away. Nietzsche for his own opening on Zion. Stifling dagger flies in. It's a good ice pump and dual press. So Zion will swallow movement speed. Defensive disruption in the back lines. Nietzsche was already going in. Same with Yamsort. Defensive snowball. In fact, they're coming over towards Madara. This will fall underneath the tier one tower. They don't even get the snowball stun. Have they got enough damage? Yep. Necro will end up falling. Yamsort is dying pretty quickly too. Madara's going to stay on the back of him and maybe he can find a little bit more of his own tier one tower. It's a two for one trade off. Doom is lost for nothing of value is, is down. And Puppy now trapped inside the river. Spirit pulling him back in again, allowing Madara just to stand, seal and deliver. And where's the extra help? Nietzsche going to now try and work as hard as he possibly can uh, with the banished up Matumba to find a couple of more of these pickoffs. And they do find one. Peksu is down. Matumba still b battling up against Madara. Has to jump further out of range. Only two cool spray stacks on him. Right, and then they kind of run away. And the rest of the team, they're like, you know, PA's blinking around. Oh, yours. Into the spirit. Chessie tried to initiate, pulling back in with Tumberman, but now he BKBs. Looks to fight. Reaper Scythe. Goodbye, Void Spirit. And probably goodbye the rest of OGC. Pexu trying to battle inside of his own fire, but doesn't protect you. Deep Freak quickly popped by Matumberman. And now Madara. Maybe they try and focus on him. Zai into the snowball. They'll get their quicks done. Need to get to the front of him, however. Zai still being brought down. And Madara is a very difficult target to have sustained fights against. There's seven core spray stacks. Matumberman is just standing underneath. He doesn't really care. He'll jump back in once again, working with all the rest of his team. Five heroes down for OG. This is a stomping by Team Secret. They're going to hunt him mid. Fire Spirit Vessel Chargers ready to go. Chessie, okay. This is optimistic. Trying to battle up against a level 15 Nisha. Get extra control. It's gonna go. Just try and step yourself out of this one, Chessie. Up he goes, Pexu. It's a good doom over on the Tom, and they're committing everything they can to kill off the Phantom Assassin. Snowball saved by Zex a little bit of time, but look at him just survive. He gets all the extra heals. They're standing on top of him. OGT is five, trying to bring down the raid boss, and finally they're able to do it. Madar, however, spirit vessel up, and for all of the commitment that OGC do, yep, you end up killing off the PA. A huge streak to end. Good money, but it all went to Z Freak. He's about to get shot, blocked up, and killed. He's trying to enter into his own base. The only player left alive is the Jakuro. <laughs> this is good practice against a high tier team. Doom. Trying to purge himself free of the control, but the Impetus flies forward. Already down to 50%. 
And Jesse looking for his own target. Overwatch Puppy is a good ice pump. They'll need the macro fire and every other bit of damage they've got to kill the puppy. And it looks like Team Secret already cutting their losses. Jesse, he wants to find Zai, but because they've split up their attack, they actually haven't got a single kill. OGC Demarine having to retreat while Yapso brings them all straight back into the fight. Reaper Scythe comes down and Doom goes from it. Maybe they have some damage, but Void Spirit, so much life being removed from him, he has to Astral step himself away to safety. The Ice Pass from Jakira continue to create space, but Madara, he just doesn't have the life to sustain this. At least got the back to block. Yeah. The Chessy is gone, and the teammates aren't really there from OGC to continue this defense. No, I mean, like they did. That, that's the biggest thing, like they did a lot of like really nice plays. Uh, but I think it was a mistake to have this crystal as a carry. Like the Doom pick was interesting, right? But uh, I think it was very like simple-minded. The like they're like, yeah, we want to be able to kill this Amber Spirit, right? So we can do that. All right, Doom, we Doom it. Yeah, it's Doom like, deletes hero, right? right? And then we win game. They, they needed something more powerful than this. Can't expect G is finally yeah. called. Yeah, he can't expect uh, first pick a Bristol back, and then he's supposed to carry the game. Like that's not cool. Well, on the hard life, is it? And yeah. Team Secret will be able to 2-0 against...